is Reporters Take. I'm Sakshi Batra and I have with me my colleague Shreya Nandi and we are here to talk about how the Income Tax Department is moving forward to simplify the whole process of filing taxes easier and simple for all the taxpayers. Uh, thanks very much Shreya. Seems like good news and we have been here and uh, watching how the government is moving forward in this regard. Earlier also there have been many steps, steps taken by the government in this and uh, the latest that we are hearing is about the pre-filled form. Why don't you tell all the viewers about what this pre filled form is and how will it uh, make the whole uh, hassle uh, what you know process of uh, the whole tedious process of filing income tax returns easier and simpler so as we all know, uh, filing income tax return file has been a uh, really not a very simple process for everybody. So the income tax department is coming out with a pre-filled income tax return form. So we exactly don't know the timelines and the details of when it will be out. Okay. But the income tax department will be filling in certain details uh, from uh, you know regarding income from other sources as well in okay. your IT form. And if you want, uh, you can make certain changes, modifications, and then submit it. It would actually make the pro entire process much more uh, simple than earlier it was also uh, you know for people with an annual uh, income of rupees 50 lakh mm -hmm. uh, there could be soon a single page uh, you know uh, income tax return form this is what uh, mr sushil chandra the ch uh, chairman of cbdt told us yesterday at an industry event absolutely so these are some very good news coming in for the taxpayers now simpler forms already which were existing will also be available for uh, people with higher income tax bracket and they will also be able to access this simpler form and also pre-filled form will be something that you will have where uh, the IT department will be able to fill in, will, uh, fill in the uh, details on your behalf before and then you can just modify. That is something good but apart from this what are the other measures that the IT department is taking to simplify the procedure, uh, procedures and also to enhance the compliance as well. So the government is also trying, the income tax department is trying to process the income tax returns uh, in a week's time, which is I think is a big, big, big right. uh, step towards it. Another uh, point that was uh, discussed yesterday at an event by Mr. Chandra was said there has been till now there has been a 50% jump in the number of tax returns filed, okay. which has already crossed 6 crore. Also, there, Sakshi, there is another data regarding mm -hmm. uh, refunds. This refunds is something that we all wait Absolutely. for. Absolutely. And uh, the government has actually done, uh, taken various steps to uh, process the refunds uh, in a much faster way. Mm -hmm. So till now, 2.27 crores of refunds amounting to 1,20,000 crore have already been filed by the, uh, had already been processed by the income tax department. And in addition, uh, another good news is that uh, now, in the uh, if you apply for an e-pan, you can actually get it in the next three to four hours. It is as simple as that. All right, so lots of big news coming in from that uh, conference that uh, CBDT chairman held, and now even. Even uh, PAN card will be easily available to all the taxpayers uh, or the people who are seeking the PAN card in three to four hours time. I think uh, the government is more and more relying on technology and automation and data analytics to make the entire uh, process, uh, you know, simpler, simpler for all the people. And uh, what we are seeing is that there will be less and less human interface as well. And probably this can also lead to lesser corruption is what the government is also planning to take. So now you also pointed out that, you know, the government's revenues will also be somehow enhance and definitely that's one uh, point that the government is looking at which is why the government is also making all these processes easier so that there could be higher compliance and the government could get uh, better revenue uh, on this front as well so where are we currently standing at uh, in terms of the revenue target that the government has so sakshi uh, for this financial year mm -hmm. uh, the target of the income tax department is 11.5 lakh crore correct so if you remember even last year mm. the government had exceeded direct tax collection target right. and uh, mr chandra is confident that this year again that the government will be able to meet this direct tax uh, collection target which is 48 percent the okay. uh, tax department has already achieved 48 percent of its target so but, far so far mm -hmm. but uh, it's important to note that in uh, generally tax returns uh, tax collection improved in the last two months of the quarter right. or the last three months of the quarter when people you know, at of the, the end entire of year, maybe in the quarter three or quarter four, people, that is why in the second half. Exactly. Honey has also mm. given uh, the entire credit to demonetization, this entire yes. widening of tax base and increased of revenue because of better uh, compliance has been given to demonetization by the government. Absolutely. Thanks very much, Shreya, for sharing all these details with us. Well, lots of good news coming in on that from the government and the IT department is working uh, forward to make the whole entire process of filing of returns simpler for people. 
PAN cards will be available to us in three to four hours is what the government also claims. And other than that, the government, uh, government is definitely confident of meeting the revenue target and also overshooting the revenue target. Lots of good news coming in on that front. But for sure, uh, what's awaited is to let uh, to get to know when will this entire process be launched and we, uh, whenever we'll get the details. Shreya, we would hope that you will give us the, those details as well on money control. Thanks very much for watching us in this edition of Reporters Take and Do. Stay logged on to moneycontrol.com for more news and updates. Thanks for watching.